Hello, my name is Ryan Dark, and I'm a certified SolidWorks application engineer here at Go Engineer. In this Go Engineer Quick Tips video, I will be discussing the use of replace face to make more complex geometries more quickly uh, than other options available to you. So you see before you a component I've made. It has a little bit of an undercut as well as some drafted sides that make it a little bit more complex than just a simple extrusion would make. Um, so how I've done this, I've uh, first created the boss extrusion using just a rectangular profile, uh, including the draft within the boss, uh, so it has its slanted sides. From here, I created a surface extrusion, which uh, I want my geometry to look like. And uh, in this case, if we were to extrude from a location on the part up to this face, it would fail for probably because of the undercut. It's, uh, it's an ambiguous solution, so it would fail to do an extrusion up to surface. Uh, so in this case, uh, I've used the replace face command, and we'll go inside of it, um, whereby I've selected the face on the solid body that I want to replace, and I've selected the surface that I've extruded out to replace it. Oop. And when it generates, it simply moves all of the faces adjacent the replace face out to that surface body and creates the geometry filling everything in. Um, this body remains solid. Um, you'll notice it only takes three features where previously if you did it with other commands you would have to include extra material and possibly cut it away. Could be just maybe a little bit messier but uh, uh, this gives you another option to work with. So uh, this has been Ryan Dark with Go Engineer. I hope you enjoyed this video. Check out our other videos for more tips on using SOLIDWORKS.